Kamusta? Namiss niyo na ba ang mag-swimming? Nakasisit na ba kayo sa dagat? Nakakita na ba kayo ng iba't ibang isda? Since may pandemic, sa aquarium na lang muna tayo makakakita ng iba't ibang uri ng isda. Kung namiss na kami, mas namiss din namin kayo. So, welcome to our TLE class. I miss Kagayan, GA TLE teacher. Our first quarter topic in TLE 8 is about food or fish processing. Just sit back and relax. And make sure that you have your paper and pen with you as well as your printed module. Our topic class for quarter 1, week 1, use and maintain food processing tools, equipment, and utensils. Tara, let us learn today. But before we proceed, these are the technical terms. Equipment, tools, or any supplies needed for a certain purpose. Tools. Devices or implements used for certain function in salting, curing, and smoking. Utensils, tools used in the kitchen, particularly in salting, curing, and smoking. Salinity, pertains to the degree of saltiness of the water. Smoking, application of smoke to the fish using hot or cold types of smoking. And the last, curing, application of salt, spices, and other preservatives. First, we have measuring tools. Salinometer, used for measuring the salinity of the brine. Refractometer, used for measuring sugar concentration of sap and syrup for food. Weighing scale, used for measuring the weight of raw materials and ingredients. Liquid measuring cup, used for measuring liquid ingredients. Measuring cup, used for measuring dry ingredients of large quantity or capacity. Measuring spoons, used for measuring small amount of solid and liquid ingredients. Cutting implement. Used for cutting fish and other ingredients. Second to cutting tools, scissors. Used for cutting purposes like pins of fish. We have other tools like cutting board. Serve as guide for cutting fish, meat, and other ingredients. Basin. Used in preparing brine and other curing mixtures. Food tongs. Used for lifting hot objects or food. Wooden ladle. Used in mixing ingredients. Pillar. Used in removing the skin of fruits and vegetables. Grater. Used for grating cheese. Earthen pots, used for storing the salted products, kilala sa tawag na alayok. Wooden salting bath or barrel, a container where the salted fish are placed or fermented. Okay, we have equipment class and first smoke house, a device used for smoking, fish or meat with the application of smoke. Equipment also in impulse sealer used for sealing purposes. Gas range oven. This is the source of heat. Chiller or refrigerator necessary in maintaining fish freshness. Pressure cooker An airtight cooking device that cooks food quickly, thanks to the steam pressure that builds up inside the steam, also makes the food moist, which is why this device is perfect for meats too, cheesecakes, and much more. Let me 
see if you learned something today. Try to identify the different fish processing tools, equipment, and utensils. Number one, it is used for salinity reading. What is this? Salinometer. Very good. Next, it is necessary for maintaining fish freshness. What is this? Very good. Chiller or freezer. Next, it is used for cutting fish and other ingredients. What is this? Very good. Cutting implement. Next, it is a device used for smoking meat, fish with the application of smoke. Yes, this is a smoke house. And the last, it is used for storing the salted products. What is this? Very good, earthen fats. Okay, so please do your activity number one, two, three, and do not hesitate to send your output in your respective group chat or GC. For your tagubilin, first, all you have to do is to find at least 10 equipments, tools, and utensils at home that is used in food fish processing. Demonstrate the function of each item through pictures or drawing. So, ang gagawin nyo, maghahanap lang kayo ng 10 equipment na meron kayo sa bahay na ginagamit sa food and fish processing. Then, pwede nyo picturean kung meron kayong cellphone. Pag wala naman, i-drawing nyo yun. Number two, take a picture of your output and send it to your TLE group chat. Number three, Please be guided to the following criteria in grading your output. Accuracy. Submitted 8 to 10 drawing or pictures, you have 25 points. Submitted 5 to 7 drawing or pictures, you got 15 points. Submitted 1 to 4 drawings or picture, 10 points. Neatness. Pag sinabing neatness, malinis ang pagkakagawa, pagkakadrawing. So, you have 20 points. Then, if you submit on time, you get 15 points. So, for the total of 60 points. I hope you learned something today, class. Thank you and keep safe, everyone. See you, see you next time. Bye!